my dad. This is right there. My mom. E. And Isa's over there. Somewhere. Thank you. Isa? He said he's tall enough to go by himself. He's in the go kart. My mom going through the I think and then it's my turn. And the kids are over here. <laughs> Mommy <laughs> Are you okay? Lisa's going through now. <laughs> my mom. My dad. Go, oh, daddy. I love her so much. I just got out of the gym. I'll listen to it in just a second. She's been live for almost two hours. The gym is back there. I just finished working out. Look how nice. It's super nice. Hey guys, I was just in my car again because I just did the interview with my sister. We were there for more than 90 minutes and we were on the phone before that just talking a little bit. Literally, we could talk all day and go so deep i cannot wait for it to be out as soon as she has she gives me the link i will share it with you guys and have you listen to it if you feel called it is a long conversation but you'll know if it's um something that feels aligned and juicy but we talk a lot about language and just my experiences of when i moved to the u.s and being bilingual and you know how that feels my loves i just got out of the shower and here is the podcast it's already live she mentioned that she did not edit anything out of it oh my gosh it was such a pleasure i will link it down below tune in to a soul filled conversation with alma gonzalez where we discuss linguistic historical legacies and navigating life and school after moving from mexico to the u.s in the 90s we discuss her language journey and how it shaped her identity throughout her childhood. Hello my love, today is Friday, it is the evening now and I am about to start putting dishes away. I just got a little bit of energy and, and I'm feeling like I want to sort of organize a little bit so that I, w I when I wake up tomorrow, it's going to be um, not as disorganized as, um, as it is currently. But I've been so sleepy all day. I feel, hmm, what do I feel? I'm in the integrating process of so many different things. And yeah, I'm so sleepy. And I really do think that it has to do 
with the level of deep work that I have been doing. As you guys saw earlier, we were sitting around on the table. That was like earlier in the day and I joined a live. We, you know, I got a lot of spiritual tools and embodiment practices and just so many activations on a deep cellular level that I am just, my physical body is feeling wiped out and I needed to nap and I still do but I, I got a little bit of energy right now but other than that we have just been chilling the both of my kids are at home We're, we have just literally been enjoying the day earlier I just had this moment of gratitude of just feeling so safe so loved on by the divine masculine through my husband through my home through so many different ways hi baby i'm back little isa wanted my attention for a second anyway yeah i have been feeling so much gratitude so i've been journal journaling up a storm on top of um feeling grateful just so many different ahas and like just things that have been coming together i know i mentioned this um in the last vlog but i just feel like I'm at a point in time where everything is coming together for me to just truly spread my wings and soar for the first time in my life. I, I just don't feel that in this lifetime I have, I have had a point where it was takeoff time, where everything just tied together. It has always felt like a journey, like, I mean, life is a journey and all of that stuff, but I. I just feel, hmm, it's really hard to put into words, I feel like I'm, I'm at a place where I can use everything that I have learned in the past and it all ties together and yeah. That's amazing, Jace. Oh. Is there coins in there or is this the album? Starbucks a little bit ago guys and I got the sugar something 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 I'm, I'm slowly twisting it yes baby is gloomy it is cold you can't see but it's kind of like drizzling rainy look at that sky anyway I oh, I just bumped my camera um I came with drenched hair again I took a shower and then I came straight to the nail bar and it air dried so it's looking a little crazy and I got ballet slipper it is such a pretty color he was sharing with me how um, it is so popular they usually run out of this color and I think it looks really good it looks like I don't know just my style what I like and I also got a pedicure and I up I like what is it called when they do like add-ons like you know how they have like basic and then the next option and then the option after that so I chose the middle one because I wanted like a sugar scrub and I wanted like the ex extra massage and I was getting massaged by the chair and it was so lovely it feels really good I am feeling a little bit emotional um and yeah and i'm feeling emotional nothing related to anything other than just this remembrance of home and star seeds and andromeda and this is just something that i've been diving deeper for myself and i feel it's not emotional it's not necessarily like what i'm feeling it's like this intense happiness and gratitude and just words are not they're not doing it for me to describe this 
I just feel this immense love, immense love that I, just looking at pictures and things like that, I, I like, I feel, I feel so much that I want to cry. Um, so there's that. What else have I been up to? I know I blogged Jace's birthday and then I haven't blogged too much after that, but what is today? Anyways, today is Sunday. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Um, we might do something. We were talking about going out to dinner or something like that. Um, but remember love, love days every day. Um, yeah. Mm hmm. No. We're practicing being patient. No. Mm hmm. Still, I'm on the TV. I mean, and as you get older, it feels like, like I know I'm in my 40s and I'm like, ah. Loves, I just got out of my workout. We had to run around this thing. It's like do a whole lap. And it was so hard, like always, because it was at the end of our workout. Got myself a mermaid drink. And I got Isa a smoothie. But anyway, now I'm gonna go take these to Jace's school. And I brought a Sharpie pen, but not like a Sharpie Sharpie. So I tried writing Jace's name and his classmate's name, but it like erases. So I think I'm just gonna take them like this. Oh well. Yeah, these are real, but I'm only putting one on each end so you can take a picture. You ready? Oh, yeah. Can you put them in there? Can you mommy? Okay, there we go. It says Sorry, this thing's drawing. Good $2. Job. It is in the register, so I can keep it. That's fine. That's good. Yeah. The swords. That's not locked now. It's locked, yep. Yeah. And then... If you put this in and you turn it to the right a little bit and now it's open. Oh. And then if you turn Loves, it to I need to take a shower so bad. So I went to the gym, right? And then I came home. Okay, baby. And I came home and then I went to go get Jace a little while later. So I like was doing something so I didn't get a chance to. But anyway, I was coming on here to show you this. I took him to a rare coin shop. And it's called um, Rare Coins in Raleigh. And the reason why I wanted to show you this is because it was the coolest experience for my boys. First of all, I took Jace there for his birthday. And he gifted each of my kids a coin. Um, the nicest gentleman. He is owner there. And uh, I so recommend it. It was the coolest experience for my kids. I couldn't have asked for something um, better. So this one is for Jace. And... Jay spent all of his birthday money there, which was really cool because he got a lot of really cool coins and he got to hold a $20,000 coin as well, which is uh, such a cool experience. They also have a uh, dinosaur egg, right? Yeah, and mommy, I didn't spend all of it. I got a dollar. Oh yeah, I have to give Jace a dollar back. This one is Isai's coin that he gifted him, which, what? Like to me, that's just such a beautiful gift. Thank you so much. Um, and then, yeah, Jace got the coolest silver coins. He has such a nice little collection going. Isa also got a box there. And, yeah. It comes with three keys. The keys are actually pretty cool. No, I just took And then key. there's like a space key. for coins up there that Isa got. This is the one that my mom gifted Isai. And Jace got one just like this one. It is... The Mexican silver coin that I was telling you guys about in the last vlog. It's so hot. My kids so into coins now. I'm like geeking out as well. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, you know what my favorite part was about in the rare coin shop? It was the silver, the it's silver open, little like. Open, they had like silver. What are they called? Like giant silver coins. They were in coins. Yeah. They were like little plaques. Oh, and mommy, they're not called plaques. I have one. Like little. Ah. Anyways, let me look. What you saw? I love how it fits. Why is that so satisfying <laughs> to me? <laughs> Hello, my love. Today is Tuesday. I am 
feeling a little tender my heart's a little tender I cried a lot earlier I did two journeys um, through meditation like through different two different meditations they were really good they were very deep but then some things were coming up for me that I needed to release and it felt really good I journaled a lot like they were really good awesome journeys I'm so grateful that I am in the container that I'm in um, you know talking about I, I think I talked about this earlier in my vlog the archetype of the medicine woman and what that means and just you know all of the subjects that like I cannot get enough of such as the womb and the body and embodiment and the quantum and wealth coding energetics behind it all so so good anyways so I have a call tomorrow today's was canceled and I think it was that's a really good thing because I needed to rest today so I did I watched a little bit of Netflix and I just lay low I chilled the entire day I just took the most beautiful luxurious bath a little bit ago it was so nice here's Mr. DC you want to say hi hi you look so cute you're so cute. Thank you. I love that color on you. It's so cute. Um, oh, yeah. And I wanted to go ahead and end the vlog here so I can start a brand new one tomorrow. I know that la this vlog, I started it on Jace's birthday, which was last Wednesday. So, I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah. You want a balloon? Yeah, I'll try it. Um, I'll check, okay? Um, thank you so much I for watching. Check it okay, my baby. And I will see you on. Oh, thank you, baby. On another day. Mm -hmm. On another day. Bye. Yeah.